Hi, good morning. It's eight in the morning and I'm, I'm freezing. I've been awake since four in the morning answering emails, uh, thanking people uh, for, for all the help that we are receiving. I want to I wanna remind you uh, what has happened in the last 48 hours. It's, uh, it's really important. About 48 hours ago, I sat here in my car and I made a video, I made an appeal, and I explained uh, to all of you that uh, we have reached a, a, a breaking point. Uh, over the last few months, uh, fundraising hasn't really worked as uh, it used to, as, an, as it expected, and we were not able to cover our st standing vet bills. I want to emphasize something. Uh, the people that are helping right now are not helping us to save an animal. They're not helping us to save Laika or Gordy or Gino or anybody in particular. What they're doing is they are helping us cover past bills. They are helping us survive right now and continue our work into the future. What this means is very important. This is not an action to save one life. This is a validation of the work of many for many years. And this is an incredible expression of trust and love. And uh, this moves us so much, so much. I want to, I want to emphasize something. In this organization, when something goes well, every success, every life saved is a thanks to the work of many people. From our vets, our tech assistants, the people working at the White House, the Pink House, but above all, it's thanks to you. But, what so, but when something goes wrong, when something goes wrong, like it has gone right now, it is my responsibility. For good or for bad, I'm the one uh, taking management decisions. Uh, I have a team of advisors, but I'm responsible for the decisions and I'm therefore responsible for our favors. Uh, this, is, this is what is called owning, owning your decisions. So everything that goes wrong is my responsibility. It, is, it may not be my fault because over here there's been uh, many factors at play, saving too many lives, maybe helping too many people, uh, not being strong enough to say no to some requests, um, a change in the algorithm of uh, Facebook and social media, uh, Facebook blocking our posts, uh, YouTube not monetizing our videos, etc. Me not being good enough at fundraising. Also. But as I say, this is an incredible, uh, you know, expression of support, and uh, I can't be happier. Um, it's going well. We are about halfway, a little bit more of halfway, of what is needed to cover our standing bills. When we reach that point, we will be on zero. <laughs> We will be an organization that has nothing, but that, but that's okay, because uh, because if this proves something, is that we have an incredible community behind us, and and that we can count on you. I am incredibly moved by your reaction. We've had lots of support. We've had offers of help people wanting to organize a concert here, uh, an activity in a school over there. Then there is a girl that is getting married and instead of giving gifts to the people at her, at her wedding, they have donated us the money. Uh, there are kids in a school doing plays. There are kids giving their weekly allowance to us. 
it's so incredible. It's so incredible. And so moving. I think I'm gonna be indebted to you uh, forever. Anyway, tomorrow I'll, I'll make another video and explain uh, how some of the things that have happened happen, if, if you're interested. Uh, and uh, I will also tell you what I plan, what we plan to do for the future. For now, this is just a video to say thank you from the bottom, from the depth of my heart for your, for your support. And uh, if you haven't helped yet, I hope my voice uh, is convincing you to do that. Please, if you can, just uh, help us get out of this and continue saving lives. Thank you.